So let us come back and see the next set of reactions, aliphatic conversions. Now in the exam paper, such questions will be given. Mostly, first important thing is, most of the students get panic seeing that such a big name, nothing to worry. First, try to learn the nomenclature. First, you need to know what are the reactants, what are the products. So mostly, students ask me, ma'am, if I just write the structure and leave, will I get mark? You will not get mark for that. You need to at least to get one mark, at least try to, because basically three conversions are given to you, each carrying one mark. So at least you need to write 50 percent to get that half mark but if you write the structure and go you will not get let's see this they've given me two chlorobutane so butane parent chain one two three four if i start from here one and two this is chloro this is ch3 ch2 this is hydrogen this is ch3 two chlorobutane one need to convert i need to convert to three uh, three four dimethyl hexane hexane is six carbon so parent atom is one two three four five six so if i have to start suppose if you are uh, starting from here one two three in the uh, or here also not a problem three four let us write three four ch3 three and the fourth carbon three methyl fill in all the hydrogen ch2 this hydrogen to this h to this ch3 for the ch2 this is what is a thing now if i have to convert now what observe carefully what do you have here one two three four here what do you have one two three four five six right six carbon that means two are extra so what which one will add those extra uh, this one two chlorobutane they said okay fine that means already they are one two three four but i need to add that uh, 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 ring but one important thing you have to remember is this is four but here you have two more groups attached that means totally it is six seven eight isn't it it's eight here there are four i can comfortably add one more group to this yes so i'll make this two hope you understood let me come back four carbons here eight carbons here if i make this as two that means two four four plus four eight over i can simply add to this the woods reaction that is two na so two na comes out as nacl two the same thing is substituted so this is important here what do you do NaCl this is in the presence of dry ether you need to write all the conditions what is the reaction Wood's reaction that's it you can directly write like this now next one they've asked me 2 methyl 1 propane to 2 chloro 2 methyl propane let us write prop propene they said 1 2 3 1 propene second carbon methyl so fill this hydrogens 4 and this is 2 this is 2 methyl 1 propene now they said 2 chloro 2 methyl propene let us write 1 2 3 so 2 methyl 1 carbon 2 carbons in the second position 2 methyl and they said propane nothing to do fill in the hydrogens h now compare here there is one carbon done for this there is one carbon one methyl one carbon one methyl here there is no double bond this is alkene this is alkene there is extra hydrogen added to this extra hydrogen added to this which will add that hydrogen to this simple what what should i do uh, if i have to break this just break the bond here they said two chloro isn't it so what did we write two chloro two methyl so should i write that chloro i have not written that chloro cl okay now it is right yes two methyl two chloro propane now simple i need to add one hydrogen to this here one cl to this so add hcl this is h plus cl minus negative addendum adds to the car uh, uh, carbon having uh, lesser number of hydrogens so to the second carbon this bond is broken this hydrogen comes in adds to this and this chlorine comes in adds to this over yes done now let's see this now what do they ask me nitromethane to to dimethyl amine nitromethane okay ch3 no2 to dimethyl amine they said that means there are two carbon systems two methyl groups in the presence in the center there is amine okay this is ch3 this is ch3 right now this is nh so when i have to see this carbon this is no2 so no2 always this nitro gets converted to amines amines on further uh, it will get converted to this let me see what can i do first convert nitro group to amines to convert nitro group to amines i need to use a reducing agent sn by hcl then i'm going to get nh2 done because oxygen is lost hydrogen is added nh2 this hydrogen is added and oxygen is lost over methyl amine 
now what am i going to do i can easily okay whenever you get this n immediate thing which you can do is you can do carbyl amine reaction in the presence of chloroform and hkoh then i'm going to get ch3 this is already there nc isocyanide because i need that nitrogen here isn't it that's why i did carbyl amine reaction now ch3 is here this carbon is here this nitrogen is here now what should i do i need to add how many hydrogens four one here and three here so four hydrogens i can add this reduction process which one can i use i can use sodium in the presence of ethanol to convert that which i did already in organic reactions in three days then immediately that con gets converted one hydrogen adds here three hydrogens add here and this becomes dimethyl amine 